Hello guys, welcome back to yet another interesting video. So recently Samsung have rolled out One UI 6.1.1 for Samsung S24 series. In a last video, we spoke about some amazing AI features which Samsung have added with One UI 6.1.1. But other than AI features, Samsung have added more interesting features on Samsung S24 series. Today in this video, we'll talk about all those features. So now without wasting any more time, let's get started. So here I have my Samsung S24 on which I'm running Samsung One UI 6.1.1. Though in the about section, it do says 6.1 but it's this 6.1.1 build which is based on android 14 and security patches of 1st august 2024 also if you see these change logs they did introduce the samsung ai features and along with ai features there are a few more interesting changes what they have done which you can see here and guys now before moving ahead if you guys like our content and if you think it's useful for you guys then make sure to smash the like button and also consider subscribing to our channel and guys if you have missed out a video of ai features you can find the video in the description below make sure to check out those amazing ai AI features introduced by Samsung. Now talking about the first change other than AI so that's led to YouTube PIP mode. So the change is if you are playing any video in PIP mode now you can easily switch to split screen mode you just have to long press and hold on this PIP mode you can see you'll get these options drop here to open split screen. If you want to drop it towards the bottom side you can do that or else you can move the PIP mode towards the top side and you'll get an option to drop the video. So soon you drop here you can see the video opens in split screen mode and towards the bottom side they have arranged it quite well like you can open the recent applications and here system will also show you most used applications and if you scroll down more you have all the list of applications which are installed on your device you get the option to search and also an option to open the app drawer so this is first change what they have done few other changes are layered to file manager so here in the file manager now they have made it quite easy to copy paste files from one location to another location so for example here i have a file i'll just tap on copy and you can see we have a pop-up menu which opens up instead of going back and then looking for the folder now one ui 6.1.1 gives an pop-up option where you can copy that particular file also another change what they have done in my files now they have given the option to create shortcuts directly on the home screen so here if i select the file long pressing on it and now i can move the file Using my other finger, I can just go to the home screen and drop this file here. The shortcut have been created for this particular file. For easy access, I just have to tap as it's a PDF file. So it's asking me to select the application. I'll show you another example. So we have this image, I long press on it. Now I'll go to the home screen and place it here. Now for that particular image, we have a shortcut tapping on it. That image will be opened directly. And it's not only limited to individual files, you can long press and select the folders later on create shortcut on the home screen for that particular folder itself. So here you can see we have a screenshot folder tapping on it. You can access all the screenshots from that particular folder. And the last change is layer to thumbnails in the file manager. Now all the thumbnails or the preview appears in the original aspect ratio instead of those cropped one. Talking about next change which is layer to profile card. Now One UI 6.1 lets you design and share your profile card. Towards the top side you'll find an option create profile card tapping on it this is the one which i have custom created and you get all other options like you know portrait studio which recently introduced which uses ai that's the reason i'm recommending to watch the ai video before watching this one after that you have some effects like oil paint ink etc with the portrait studio you can make changes like you can create cosmic profile card 3d profile card and more you can also tap on preview and see how will it look once you are done if you go to profile card and picture you get a new option share profile card and picture so if you enable this you have options like share with contacts only or everyone so like whenever you call them they'll be able to see your profile card depending on the selection what you have done and in the phone application there's another change what they have done so if you go to answer and ending calls there are two changes what you'll notice one of them is layer to gesture so previously we had the option to swipe to receive the call but now they have also added an option where you can just tap on the icon to receive a call and after that there's another option which says answer using speaker so here if headset or bluetooth is not connected soon you pick up the call the audio output will be from the speaker instead of earpiece and later on samsung have also increased the security on one ui 6.1.1 so if you use auto blocker there's a new option they have added which says maximum restrictions so if you enable maximum restrictions it'll do things like turn on app protection block device admin apps block hyperlinks and previews for the gallery also it will block shared albums and remove location data when sharing pictures so this is very useful feature and if someone wants to make any kind of changes in the security the device will always ask for authentication and the last change is what they have done and that's layered to the samsung health application so here they have added a lot of ai stuff i'm yet to test this samsung health application with my samsung watch 6 so very soon i'll post a video regarding this so guys these are all the other changes what samsung have done with one ui 6.1 
and if you guys want me to cover more samsung video then make sure to let us know in the comment section this is your friend ashok signing out see you guys in the next video